Hey guys, uh, it's another pointless as, or another let's make an operating system on PowerPoint. And today we're going to be doing the login. Now if I maybe just open up another PowerPoint and I will show you just an example from my old one. Here we go, so we've got the nice design of the login but we're going to completely redesign it I think. Excuse me for a second. Okay, right, we're in Photoshop and you don't exactly need to, but this is just something that I might do. Uh, actually, if I create a new thing and just make it mine custom, like um, 500 by 500. Okay, there we go, right. Now if we create a new layer, this is just going to be what the buttons are going to look like. You don't you don't have to do this, it's just that I like to make my stuff look fancy. Because I'm like that. Yeah, right. Nope, need a bit lighter than that, maybe say about there. Yep, that looks good. Yep, there. Okay, that's looking pretty nice. Um, that's pretty much all, because you can just use a grey little block, really. So, just gonna save that. In PNG, and it's login button. I'm gonna make it kind of like have a little tiley effect for the login like um, Windows 8 because I love that design. <laughs> I still need to get it though. Right, I'm gonna create a new slide and before we actually um, start off I might put the um, might make it another colour like no not orange Maybe maybe a nice blue or Yeah that looks nice. We'll keep it at that. Uh we'll fill this with blue as well. And if you want you can add a little transition to it. So if we go to transitions, we've got different things we could do, maybe a push, maybe a cut, maybe just a fade. Maybe a reveal, random bars, a shape, a fracture, a drip, a flash, a fall over. There's some good ones down the bottom here. Gallery. Nope. Um. Oh, where is it? There we go. Right. So I just got a nice little transition there. And so now if we watch it all through, it goes operating system me, loads up, and then which this is gonna be the login. Let's insert a text box. Let's just say login. Ah, you know. Profiles. Right, we want to make this calibri light. Like so. Do that. Oh god, let's come off the edge. That's what she said. Right. Right, just gonna size this one up a bit. Right, I'm gonna put it at the thing and then I'm gonna go drawings all that align distribute vertically. No, I don't mean that. I mean uh align distribute horizontally. There we go. Right. So we have the nice thing and now we're just gonna insert picture or at this point you can just insert a little square shape. 
It's up to you, really. That was ages ago, and I was trying to mess him up. Don't kill me. Right. Recent places. Why don't I just go to there? Oh, no. No, because that never works. Does it? No, that, nev no, that never works. Let's make an operating system. The login thing. Maybe quite big, but then we can just size it down. There we go. Oh. Gonna make four accounts. Um, Ryan, let's just make these in line as well. Oh no, no, oh god. Did we do distribute horizontally? Mm, that looks good. Right. <coughs> we can close that as well now. <coughs> god, I've got a bad cough. Anyway. So, now what we're going to do is we're going to have to fill these with text well firstly what we're gonna do is we're just gonna grab some pictures sample pictures right so let's have one of them have flower for their profile picture uh, that looks nice um, but this needs to be There we go. So now I can base all my croppings off this. Uh, so I'm just going to pause this and then I'll be back once I've done all the images. And we're just going to insert one more picture. There's going to be penguins because everybody loves penguins. And that. There, and just crop it to the picture. So it's easier when you've done the um, first few because it just makes it nicer. Okay, yep, that, that works pretty well. So the next thing we're going to need to do is we're going to need to have the names underneath. So um, I'm just going to use the same names as I did on my previous one which were James um, let's make that in the middle there put that there turn it white and make it calibri light there we go Dave Just gonna do Philip and Stan. We've got names like this. That's a nice login. And so now we're just gonna go and group all of these together. All I'm doing is I'm just hitting control, selecting all of them, right hand clicking, hitting group, and then group. So all of these are in groups now. Um, so yeah, that's the end of part one. And then the next part will add like animations to it and make it so when you click a password will show up, that kind of stuff. Anyway, this has been a pointless as and how to be, how to make an operating system on PowerPoint. See you guys later.